We're starting here on the uh, main map screen that you'll see uh, when you first turn on the unit. And we're just going to uh, press the escape key twice, or uh, three times actually, to get to the uh, compass page. When we get to the compass page, we're going to press the uh, enter button and page the cursor down to uh, the bottom option, which is compass options, and hit enter. And we're going to select user calibration. Hit enter again. It'll say for best calibration results, place Triton on a motionless horizontal surface away from metal objects. Okay, we've done that, so I'll hit enter. Okay, now what we're going to do is uh, when we hit start, it's going to have, be an arrow that comes up, and we're going to rotate the unit uh, counterclockwise and uh, keep the arrow pointing at us. So um, once we're ready for that, and the uh, bubble is in the center of the screen, like we see there, go ahead and hit start, and there's the arrow. So we'll just swing the unit around and keep that black arrow on the outside pointing at us as we turn it. And you'll notice the uh, red stripes beginning to appear in the uh, center of the unit. When it's uh, calibrated, it'll be uh, completely red. And we're just about ready. All stripes are filled in. And it will uh, then give us a message saying, turn the unit over and wait for the beep to complete the calibration. So go ahead and do that. And there's the beep. So we turn the unit back over and it will give us a message saying calibration was successful. So we just hit OK and then we are ready to use the compass. And you can see once it's calibrated just by uh, turning the GPS uh, the compass will rotate to show uh, which direction um, you're pointing. And then to get back to the main map screen where we started, just hit either page or escape until we get back to the uh, main map.